check it out. This is the islit.org dad pack. Um, this is fire. You can get islit.org merch on our website, islit.org slash merch. Got the fire emoji. Super dope. All different types of fire emoji gear. So, try to keep it simple, you know, kind of clean cut. It's lit. Well, now, what's up? It's Dill. I'm coming at you from Philly, and this is Bad Hair. You know what? Um, I'm still figuring it out. I think that when I I just always loved freestyling. So it all started like I started listening to rap, um, you know, as a kid, like middle school, high school, just listening to rap music. Like at the time, this is like when Meek Mill was first blowing up, Maybach music and like Rick Ross were real big. So I used to listen to them and uh, I would just freestyle with my friends, me and my buddy Wes Walker. And then we made my song Jordan Belfort. So then we put it out on SoundCloud and it just started blowing up from there. I made a song in 2015. Uh, actually, we made a song in 2014. It's called Jordan Belfort. It's a multi-platinum hit that was real big in colleges and universities. Uh, it was a top college song of 2016. And so that song's uh, now a multi-platinum hit. Uh, we toured around the country. I did like 50 to 60 shows around the US and Europe. Uh, and so I went, I did that and I released a lot of independent singles as well. And so the last few years I've been focused totally on my independent music and my record label, it's lit.org. Yeah, so I make most of my music at my home studio. Um, you know, I, this is just a song that I recorded when I was working on my new album. So I work out of my home studio, which is in Center City, Philly. And this is a new track off my album. So Bad Hair is part of my album, Crypto Rich. And it was the first one that I shot a music video for. I'm cooler than your brother. Big bag of marijuana. Just bought a bag of reefer. Hope I do not see my mama. So this line is about uh, basically, you know, just being in high school, just kind of sneaking around with my mom. You know, she never really liked when I smoked weed. So that's just, a, that was just a real problem for me growing up. So I was always sneaking around and, you know, it's just like typically you just bought a bag of weed. Like it's hope I don't see my mom. Like you, you're coming in the house or whatever late at night. Like you're trying to sneak that up to your room real quick. Like whatever, before anyone finds out. So she tells me I'm crazy. I tell her I'm sorry. Next time I won't pick up her FaceTime inside the party. All right, so this is still about my mom here. Actually, this is a reference to a real story. Uh, it's actually this one time I was at a party and this was in Vegas and I picked up this FaceTime. And I mean, I had been drinking all day and it was my mom calling and I picked up her FaceTime and I was just real turn up, let's say. I was lit. And uh, yeah, she wasn't too happy about that. Me picking up the FaceTime at a party, just getting real drunk. I was just like, woo, what up, mom? So that's what that line's about. It's like, next time, maybe I won't pick that up. If you want to see me fucked up, just ask someone from college. I increase my knowledge, but I do not recall it. Yeah, so this line's just about my time in college. I went to Tulane University in New Orleans. And you know, I used to get turned up for sure. I mean, I learned a lot and it was a great college, but at the same time, I just had some crazy memories getting turned up. And I also went on a college tour. Where I went all around the US to like 50 different colleges. So I've been to more colleges than just about anyone I know. Um, but I've been pretty turned up the whole time. 10 G's on me from crypto in the penthouse kitchen. I made lots of money, but I still do all my dishes. Yeah, so this line's just about, you know, how I made my money. I made my money off crypto. And, uh, you know, I had a dope penthouse apartment in Philadelphia. And, yeah, I mean, even though I made a lot of money, I still got to do my own dishes. So, you know, just puts it in perspective. You got to make a lot of money to not have to do your own dishes. Bitch, no, I'm not famous. Bad hell when it's raining. Just pulled up to 30th to meet you at the station. So, uh... This line is really just, uh, you know, I changed my Instagram name to Famous Dill in 2019. And, uh, you know, I just did that to really to really help me grow and uh, as a way to just have kind of an interesting, unique handle. So this line was written in 2019 when I was just like, bitch, no, I'm not famous. I don't care. I'm still gonna make my thing Famous Dill. Um, and yeah, so bad hair when it's raining. What is bad hair when it's raining? So 
you know, as you know, as you may know, especially girls, you know, when it's raining out, your hair just gets terrible. I mean, it's just hard to deal with your hair, like especially for girls, like when it's humid, your hair will be like real frizzy and everything like that. So that's where that comes from. That's bad hair when it's raining. I'm driving in a Tesla. Yes, you sit adjacent. Shout goes out to Elon, my dude knows how to just blaze it. So yeah, most of you probably saw the Elon Musk interview where he was with Joe Rogan and Joe Rogan hands him a joint and he's like, I don't really smoke or whatever, but he was just like, and he really hit that. So that's what that's about. I'm driving fast and whip, 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 whip. I'm driving fast. I'm driving fast and whip, whip, whip. Yeah, you know, I'm just driving fast. Pop another molly and thought I didn't feel it. Now I'm at the party and the floor look like the ceiling. But do not call my mama because I don't want no drama. I done lots of shit, my mama don't need no more trauma. You know, I keep talking about my mom in this song and it's just true, like I put that sweet woman through a lot of trauma. So, you know, I'm sorry, mom, I love you. <laughs> Make a call to Tommy, Tommy, he go Ronnie. Double cup of liquor and he goofy out them Johnny. It's Johnny Tommy's brother, he worked with my mother. So yeah, this is about my friend Tommy. Shout goes out to Tommy. Uh, you know, he gets goofy sometimes. He be with the double cup of liquor, you know, around the party. And Ronnie, well, you know Ronnie from Jersey Shore, so you know how it is. Um, and yeah, Johnny is Tommy's brother and he used to work with my mom. Um, so yeah, shout out to Johnny and Tommy. Bitch, I'm not a kid, but I keep that quick in the cupboard. It's funny when I take a note to fuck my day up. I gotta stay up, cause these bitches wanna play. I got my cake up and these bitches wanna pace. I'm crypto rich, no, I'm not new to getting paid. So yeah, this part, it just goes hard, you know? And uh, Crypto Rich, you know, that's the name of my album. So Crypto Rich, you know, it's about, I'm used to getting paid. I've been doing this cryptocurrency stuff for a while. Before that, I was a platinum artist. So, you know, I, I, I'm not letting anybody take advantage of me in any deal, you know? I'm always used to getting paid. I'm getting that money no matter what. I just got rich, okay? But I don't sell cocaine. In a wit wit roll rage. I'm in my little lane. So this just goes hard, man. I mean, I was just thinking of driving in that little Tesla and then, you know, I'm in my cool ass car and someone tried to cut me off. I'm like, shit, I'm mad. Now I got road rage. I'm like, Burr. I run it around any amount. I hit the bank. I'm cashing out. So that's just like, you know, I hit the bank in any amount. I'm cashing out. Like, I don't know how much you're cashing out when we go to the bank, but whatever the amount is, I'm cashing out at least that amount. Cause like, you know, I'm used to going to the bank and just making big cash outs. I mean, it's just no problem. I take your bitch, huh? Check out the whip, huh? Rocking big drums, different color, pink tongue. So this is just like, you know, I got a whip. We got some, some big knocking speakers in the back. You know, we are playing big drums and it's like, you know, paint different color ping pongs, like whatever you want, you know, maybe I got like the two-tone whip, maybe I got the two-tone drip, but it's also just uh, actually kind of a reference to the, to the type of uh, delay that I was using on this track. I had a ping pong delay, so it's kind of just like ping pong. This is your boy, Dill, AKA Famous Dill. Whoa now, this is the Bad Hair interview on All Bars Matter. Bad Hair is my new single coming at you out of Philly. We just did the music video. We brought the Tesla out to 30th Street Station. It was dope. So go check that out on YouTube. You can find all my music on streaming sites and itslit.org. Just search Dill, D-Y-L, and stay with me. Whoa now.